Here's a performance psychology tip you might like to hear. Uh, yeah, that, that's a great start. Nothing but a big giant stick. Keeper? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what the heck that is. Hold them up for some pictures. Let's say the spinnerbait is catching more fish. 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 Fishes. Oh my goodness. I mean, oh. You all right? <laughs> oh, sh My favorite hero in fishing is Bass Edge host Aaron Martin. <laughs> That's not quite what we need. We are on a pattern. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Y'all couldn't even take a straight face on that one, could you? It's like having a nice car without nice wheels. You gotta have both to complete this whole. Hold the up. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start the show with this. You know. There should be a fish. Whoa. Oh, no, you didn't. Oh, I couldn't do that again if I wanted to. Is that, is that insulated? We'll be Check this out. Not only moss in the trees, your bait. You know, we need more tips on Bass Edge of how to recover lures. Well, if you don't throw up on the rock. <laughs> okay, that's a start. I'm gonna push it right over the top. There you go. Oh, no, that didn't help. How's that? That'll be a blooper. Oh, yeah. All right, man. Let's go with the frog. As you'll notice, Aaron is throwing a frog over the top of the vegeca vegetation. <laughs> we changed the way we retrieve our woos. And I enhanced this action on this bait with a Cordell snap swivel. The snap will... Gosh, dang it. So when you have rapidly moving light conditions, they actually have a huge advantage over their prayer. Over the As you noticed, Aaron was throwing a frog over the top of the vegetation. Vegetation, start over. These are schooling fish. They're kind of like gangsters. They're out chasing and raping and raping? 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 On your next trip, try this. Make a commitment to change something every 15 seconds. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Aaron, I'm gonna, I'm sorry, gonna just try Kurt. this. Oh, oh, dude, I'm sorry. I got non-body, non non-moving body parts, and then ones that have mo moving body parts. The lure I caught my biggest fish ever on in a tournament was 10 pound, eight ounces, and that wasn't a bait. <laughs> Let me do it again. <laughs> try tying on a tube bait. You have non-body, non okay. A subtle change make, may make all the difference in the world, so you might switch to a tube, son of a... Profile, you got non... <sighs> maybe switching, maybe just a subtle change to a tube bait is all it's going to take to have a great day. Now on the profile, what I do is I have non-body, non non-moving body parts, and then moving body parts. Maybe a subtle transition is all you need by tying on a tube bait may make all the difference in the frickin' world. I have, what I do in the profiles, I have non-body, non-moving body parts. <laughs> you might try switching to a tube. Sometimes a subtle change is all it takes to have a great day. God. I have moving body parts and non-moving body parts. Bam. Right after third level decision. Okay. <clears throat> okay. I'm ready if you guys are. Three, two, one. Oh, wait a minute, stop. Was to target bass related to. Uh, Just go back to the first. This wind has picked up. Of course, we moved a little bit out closer to uh, to the main lake, and I just dropped it. Dang, gone it. Customizing baits has become extremely a pop. <laughs> okay. And what I really like about this deal right here is I can get it lined up so one cameraman can shoot the other cameraman. <laughs> and that they just love that stuff. Giddy up! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jeremy, did you get a shot of that sign right there that says private property, no trespassing? Right now. <laughs> He's standing right by. <laughs> That's good, dude. That Smile, Curdy, you're on candid camera. Okay, ready? <laughs> Did 
Too close. Today we're saw here and throwing a frog. And that's going to depend on the kind of fishing you do is the type of graph you're going to need. If you like to fish, that sucked really bad. Is that an Indian name? Do you know anything about that? How they came up with the name of this lake? Because it kind of sounds um, Indian. -er. I think it's Siberian. Really? No. You got your floating frog and you got your toad. Bam! That's the no look. <laughs> that's the no look grab. You have your fl floating frog and your toad. The toad is extremely easy to fish. <laughs> I'm Dr. J and you're in the zone. Down south it's hot. We call it triple A. <laughs> you know, hot, humid, and and uh what's the other portion? You just push it right around and you force the old hook right off, just like that. That didn't work right, but I got two hooks. <laughs> hot yeah, humid. Hot hazy humid. There it is. Triple H? Triple H. What's it's that hot, mean? hazy and humid. Uh, <laughs> a lot of people think that this is just for matted grass, lily pads. It actually goes in good on anything. Cake, cereal. <laughs> this frog looks like it's had a sex change down here in the... You ready? Yeah. <laughs> it's, it doesn't... Okay. Okay, when I choose my... <laughs> when I choose my rod, I... <laughs> You're gonna look at shade and cover. What I mean by that is walkways and oh, uh, what well, that is right there, roofs. <laughs> <laughs> that thing. That, that. I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Going into fall, there's one thing you gotta remember that the bass's metabolism is still as loud as those geese. Where's, when's, where do you get a shotgun when you need one? I wish I had me a Daisy BB gun about right now. I got a 38. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the best place to hunt is in, is in your local city park. There's a lot of preserves and uh, like eagle nesting areas. Oh, really? And, yeah, hunting areas. I hear those really? eagles yeah. taste pretty good, kind of like chicken. <laughs> don't even have to wear camouflage. It's even better when they're on their nest protecting their eggs. <laughs> they don't even get up and fly. <laughs> Well, you know, we, we still had a great day, even though we didn't catch a lot. And, um, well, I guess, I guess we caught a lot, but just w not. Let's start that again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I guess we better call it a day. That's it, huh? That's it. All as right. much as what I hate to say it. <laughs> that was some freaking worst crap up. <laughs> I was thinking that's it, huh? <laughs>